Tracy McGuffers, Tracy Sewing Studio here with tips in, in around a minute. Today I am going to be talking about tips with stitch witchery. So it is this almost like interfacing weave stuff and basically what it is is kind of glue. And a lot of people absolutely despise stitch witchery because if you are a seamstress and somebody brings you something that was hemmed or made with stitch witchery, it is almost impossible to get out. Another thing that can happen if you just use stitch witchery and you wash and dry something, it can come out and get stuck somewhere else and then leave some residue. It can be really challenging, but I'm gonna tell you that you shouldn't give up on this stuff. It's like a dollar or two. I use it to do when I do little cuffs just to put it down and little spots for suits. Um, I also take it and cut it in half so that I have half inch strips and it'll go further that way. And I use it sometimes in hemlines. So I'm making a maxi dress and this is my print, it's like little scissors. And what I've done is I need for my maxi dress so that the hemline doesn't flip up at least five eighths of an inch or my serge hemline is going to flip up. So instead of pinning all the way around this and getting some wonky like wavering and stuff like that as I put this through my sewing machine, I can, instead of pinning it, I can take the stitch witchery and put it in just underneath my surged or zigzagged line, fold it under, give it a nice press, and then put it through my machine and it's going to have a really nice crisp look. Now, if you think that you might be removing your stitches and you wanna take this off, don't use stitch witchery because it's gonna be really hard to get your stitches out and the stitch witchery out. But stitch witchery can be used for all kinds of wonderful things. So do you have other things that you use this for? I know some people will use it to hold the zippers on temporarily. Um, well, it'll be permanently, but temporarily while they sew it. Um, so all kinds of uses for this, as long as it doesn't need to be removed. I know some people use it for their curtain hemlines, which is fine as long as you don't have to wash them. So that's it, Tracy McGuffrey's Tracy Sews here in Kettering, Ohio. I mostly do alterations for money, but for fun, I like to make clothing. I like to um, make dresses and swimsuits. So if you wanna follow me on Instagram, I'm Tracy Sews. Uh, feel free to find me on Facebook, Tracy Sewing Studio. On Facebook, I have a large meetup group, Dayton Garment Designer Meetup. We meet up quarterly and do fabric swaps, any skill level, anybody can come. And that's it. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.